Well, good afternoon. It's a pleasure to be with you here this week. And as you can tell, the Lord has blessed us with rain today and how fitting that is considering the message that I brought to you yesterday on the living water. And I remind you, as I did yesterday, uh, the, the beauty in what John tells us in chapter 7 here of the setting that Jesus, uh, that Jesus declared these words. See, it was uh, during the Feast of Tabernacles, this seven-day feast in which the Jews went out and uh, they would celebrate by making these makeshift tents made out of leaves and branches and they would remember how they lived out in the wilderness. And during the seven days, they would celebrate a beautiful water ritual where they would go out and draw water from the pool of Siloam. They would go into a procession and they would go into the temple and they would pour out this water and they would remember the provision of God providing them water while they were out in the desert. And it was during this time that Jesus stood up and he said, anyone who would believe and come after him, that he would provide for them this living water that would not only quench their soul, but that from their hearts, John chapter 7 verse 38, would flow abundant rivers of this living water. And he's speaking to you and I, and he's telling us that if we would come to him, he would provide this Holy Spirit that would, from us, be abundantly overflowing so that others would be able to receive this living water that they need as well. What beautiful words and what a beautiful promise that God gives to us. And so, as the Jews remembered the water that God gave to them, and yes, the rain as well, we remember that Jesus now provides for us access to the Holy Spirit, this living water, that can offer hope to a parched, a spiritually parched world. So I encourage you this day, tell others about this water, this living water that's available to them. Encourage them in the words of Christ. I uh, hope you have a blessed week, and I look forward to seeing you soon. God bless you.